We're getting a new look at the, the problem-plagued Pawtucket River Bridge. The city of Pawtucket just received plans for the new bridge, and they shared them with us. It's a story you'll see only on Eyewitness News. Reporter Danielle North has the details from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. It is a look down the road. These plans, drawn up by the Rhode Island DOT, provide a glimpse of what the Pawtucket River Bridge will look like in the not-so-distant future. It's, it's going to be basically a lot safer than uh, the 95 bridge right now. Construction crews have been out working on some much needed repairs on the old bridge. The $2 million project will repair steel and other parts of the structure until the entire bridge is replaced. For more than a year now, 18 ton trucks caught crossing the bridge have been fined $3,000 a pop by the state because of reduced weight limits. He's on Summit Street. Pawtucket city officials say they're tired of the increased truck traffic on city streets and can't wait for the new bridge construction to begin. The type of traffic going into the city and the type of traffic we're going to lose. Uh, the type of traffic we're going to lose is un unfortunately, uh, is fortunately, the trucks. Uh, the trucks have caused uh, quite a bit of a hindrance to uh, a lot of the residents here on uh, Exchange Street. According to city officials, the new Pawtucket River Bridge project is slated to begin before summer. The DOT says it will take two to three years to build the new bridge, while certain parts will be usable sooner. The project is expected to cost tens of millions of dollars. Right now, residents of Pawtucket have just this picture and these plans as a reminder that the wait will be over soon. We're going to gain a lot of the residents who are actually in some cases avoiding uh, the actual bridge itself. Now the DOT says throughout all the troubles they do continue to monitor the situation there saying that the old bridge is still safe. They tell us those reduced weight limits are intended to reduce further deterioration until that new bridge is built. I'm Danielle North, Eyewitness News.